Welcome to this video. In this session, I'm going to talk about this uh, application part values to drawing fields. This application has been uh, modified with uh, some additional options. Let me show you the previous application, which had uh, very limited options. So this is the previous one, and this is the latest one, where you have more options. Uh, main part name to drawing title um, it will copy the part name to the single part drawing if you are applying this uh, application to single part drawings and uh, it will copy assembly name to the assembly drawings and cast unit name to the cast unit drawings once you have applied these names to the uh, drawings you can change this option to no so that you don't have to run it again if you are making some changes to the other attribute service and um, you can also add a text. Sometimes what happens is that the client might ask you to add the document the number in the drawing sheet. Of course, you can add it now and also you can choose in which field you want to pass that information. And you can delete the values from any one of these user defined attributes. That's what you can see it here. So let me just close this old one. I'm going to run this one now. Go to the document manager. Let me choose the single part drawing. Uh, I'm selecting all these drawings now. Assign values and change this option to yes. Profile to title 1 and length to title 2. Maybe this weight uh, title 3. Run this application. So 69 drawings updated in just less than 10 seconds. So you can see the names. It is actually reading the part name from the model and updating your um, document manager. That's the profile, title, and title three. And if you just wanted to pass that the document number to user field one, let me just choose the user field one here. And then enter some information. Now I don't want to run this one again, so I change all this option and then run. If you find names are missing here, obviously uh, in the model, the part name is missing. Let me update it later on. So the next one, I'm going to the assembly drawings now. So selecting all the assembly drawings. And run this application. The next one for the cast unit drawing. So now you can see the cast unit drawings. Obviously, if you wanted to delete any one of the user defined uh, attributes, or maybe the title one, two or three, you can go to the delete values. Obviously it will disable everything here. So let me change this option to no, delete values. Then I choose, uh, I just wanted to remove um, the title three. So I just go to um, title three, run. Let me just go to the single part drawing. I'm going to get rid of this um, user field one. So
You can see the advantage of doing it without opening the drawing or without opening the user defined attributes. So obviously that takes a little bit of extra time. This application actually helps me in so many ways. Feel free to get in touch with me how you can use this application to make it more efficient. Maybe you are a document manager or printing the drawings. Just let me know and thank you for watching this video.